Well, Jeb Bush arrived here at the R.E. Prescott Company in Exeter to talk about his tax policy and why he thinks it's good for both businesses and working class families. Republican presidential hopeful Jeb Bush visited R.E. Prescott, introduced by State Senator Russell Prescott, whose family has long owned the pump engineering company. He's in the state to tout a tax plan that simplifies the code, first by reducing the number of brackets from 7 to 3. 10 percent, 25 percent, and 28 percent. There is a deduction that you get, a standard deduction. We double that. So the net effect of that is if you're making $40,000 a year or less in a family of four, you won't have to pay income tax at all. Corporate rates would be lowered to 20 percent, but he also supports eliminating a loophole for wealthy hedge fund managers, making them pay higher taxes, and he'd eliminate deductions for local and state taxes. So a state like New Hampshire, where you don't have an income tax, you're subsidizing big government states like Colorado, uh, California and New York. If you eliminate that, um, you're not, you're not punish, punishing New Hampshire for being a small government state. And he couldn't avoid questions about Donald Trump's latest comments about fellow candidate Carly Fiorina. Still, I think I'm the number one uh, beneficiary of the Donald's uh, insults, but look, he's, he is who he is. He, he, he likes to disparage people. Ultimately, the guy's yeah, the front runner. He ought to be, what's his tax proposal? Well, Bush was asked about how his father, the elder George Bush, was doing after a recent fall. He says he's in good spirits, he's recovering in Kennebunkport, and that every once in a while he throws his slippers at the TV when he hears those other candidates bashing his son. Jeb Bush is on to a town hall meeting in Salem at 6.30. We're live in Exeter, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.